All right, if you want to make one of these in Excel or one of these, I'm going to show you my process. Surprisingly easy to do this, but it's not a built-in Excel chart, so a lot of people just don't realize it's possible. Let me show you. So the secret to doing this is having the same set of values twice in the same table. So we've got our dates, and then we've got sales, and we've got sales again. When we insert our chart, we're going to highlight everything, go to the Insert tab, and drop in a line chart. So here's our chart. It looks like there's only one line, though, even though we selected two series of data. Where's the other line? Well, they're exactly the same, so it's hiding behind this first one. So what we're going to do is we're going to click into this, go to the Design tab, hit Change Chart Type with this line selected. Make sure you've selected the line first. And under that, we are going to go down to 2D Area Chart and select that. What this has done is it's created two separate chart types, but they're both plotting the same data, so they're always going to align perfectly. Now, if we format this area chart beneath it, give it a gradient fill, make sure our gradient fill is linear and at 90 degrees, we can have this be a gradient from one color to whatever other color we want. And to make it look the way that you saw in my other examples, we're going to have it 100% transparent on one side, and then blue or a similar color for your design on the other, and it's gonna give us this look right here. I think these are just a fun way to jazz up what might otherwise be a sort of boring line chart. And it can also be used as kind of a fun hybrid between a line chart, which has certain advantages, and an area chart, which has other advantages from a data visualization perspective. Give it a try. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. And if you want this template or any of my other templates, check out the link on my profile to my newsletter. I send these out for free so that people have a something they can follow along with and look at while they watch these tutorials. Thanks, everybody. Have a good one. Bye.